Hey guys, so to catch you back up, uh, pick up where we left off. I am heading home from Windrock uh, after doing the wheeling with Warren thing, and um, that was a little slow, but I had this idea and I thought it'd be really cool to share with you guys. Um, if you know me, obviously you know that I love Jeeps, but something you may not know is that I actually watch a lot of YouTube, and not just, you know, my friends or whatever, but uh, I wanted to share with you 10 YouTube channels that have less than 10,000 uh, subscribers that I watch because I know that a lot of those guys are really trying hard to you know uh, get out there and get noticed and they film really great content really great stories and uh, so yeah I just thought I would bring a little bit of that to you if you're looking for some more off-road content to watch uh, so let's go okay so the first on the list is Waypoint X uh, I had the fortune of meeting with them briefly uh, at Gulch's Off-Road Park in South Carolina several years ago. I've been watching this channel ever since. And uh, they're based in Alabama. They do a lot of stuff at Stony Lonesome, which is a badge of honor trail uh, there. He does guided rides. And uh, most recently, he just went out to, uh, he and his family went out to Colorado. I uh, did some badge trails out there. And, and watching those videos kind of made me miss it. It made me miss being in Colorado and running the badge trails myself. So. Uh, kudos to him on a great job on filming that series so uh, check out Waypoint X. Now this next one is for your Toyota guys. Um, I don't know how many of you guys have actually heard of the Transamerica Trail uh, but that is a trail that has been put together in sections uh, over time and it connects essentially North Carolina uh, all the way up to uh, the Pacific Coast in uh, Washington. So that's really cool. Well, actually Oregon. Uh, so that's really cool. Um, I really need to pay attention where I'm going. <laughs> anyway, um, so if you're into Toyotas, uh, you need to check out Old Man Old Truck. So a good buddy, Phil, he is based in South Carolina, and uh, he recently completed the tat. He's got some videos on his channel uh, of driving around South Carolina trails and a couple of other things. Um, he is transitioning his uh, YouTube channel to more of a homesteading thing, which is awesome, by the way. Um, so check out Old Man Old Truck on YouTube. For those of you that might be interested in the northeast side of the country, uh, Buffalo, New York, there is a dude that goes, his channel is uh, Dark Side Off-Road. Uh, he has his JK or JL, I cannot remember, but he kind of goes all over the Northeast and a little bit of the Southeast. So I know he's been to Pennsylvania, um, obviously New York. I know he's been to Virginia, West Virginia areas. Um, he's a Star Wars fan, um, but his videos are really great. Uh, he kind of takes you through the story of their adventures and that's something that honestly I wish I could do a little bit better. But uh, I'm not there yet. I'll get there someday, maybe. I don't know. But his channel is awesome, so check out Dark Side Offer. All right, guys, the next one on the list is Ben and Brandy. Uh, their channel is new to me. Uh, I think they started at more of a uh, van life. They had an RV. I don't really know what their situation was before. Uh, then they got a JL, and he upgraded it overland style. And uh, they recently challenged themselves to hit, uh, I think, 20 badges in 30 days. Uh, they went out west, they went to Moab, did a couple of things there, they went to Colorado. And uh, all I can say is, it's not a spoiler alert, but uh, all I can say is he ended up getting a Bronco. So <coughs> take that as you will. I know some of you guys are hardcore Jeepers and you're like, whatever. I think Broncos are cool, but whatever fits them the best. I know they have some really cool stuff coming up, but they're a no nonsense, straightforward, real channel. Uh, and yeah, if you're into that kind of thing and challenges and, you know, family kind of travel as well, I uh, might want to check them out. Um, so again, that's Ben and Brandy. For those of you who really like to see the builds happen, uh, so upgrades effectively budget friendly, but make it perform the way that you really want it to, uh, a really good channel for you to check out is War Paint Off-Road. I know he's got a V8 conversion happening right now and an instant swap going on. Um, really great explanation of how to do certain things from build but he's also got some really hilarious shorts uh, so you want to check that out uh, 
that's really all I got to say about him. He does a really great job at explaining like these upgrades and, and giving you helpful tips of how to save money and build your Jeep uh, the way that you want to, the way you want to wheel it. Uh, and he's got some one-off projects as well. But uh, yeah, he's, he throws in comedy. He throws in uh, just things that will really keep you um, watching these videos, which I think is really cool. It's, again, something I can't really do, but it's cool. Um, so yeah, check out War Paint Off Road. Now, if Jeeps are your thing, that's one thing. If your Jeeps are a part of your overall like car and automotive enthusiast thing, you want to check out S3 Magazine's YouTube channel. Uh, Jonathan Woolley who runs it uh, has done a great job over the top over the years and it was a print magazine they now have an app uh, they are making posts three or four times a day uh, with excellent articles about what's going on in the automotive industry the app is free um, it's doing really well it's taken off uh, some of my friends are writing for that magazine as well and uh, again that's just kind of a no-nonsense car enthusiast focused uh, YouTube channel uh, and check them out on their app as well. Their articles are, are awesome. Um, it really keeps you in the know on a day-to-day -day basis of what's going on in the car industry so or the automotive industry I should say for car enthusiasts. So sorry I've been talking a lot and yelling a little loud. Anyway um, yeah check out S3 Magazine. Okay for those of you who really like cinematography uh, really well-framed shots, color coded or not color coded, color graded uh, sequences of adventure-style travel, so overlanding with um, the storyline, family-friendly, all that. Check out Spartan Overland. Uh, and Jesse and Daisy, husband and wife, their their kids. Uh, Daisy has a uh, a Jeep. Jesse has a Toyota Tacoma long bed. Uh, their buddy Kevin comes along sometimes as well. Uh, he's got a long bed Tacoma. And I think they had one other guy that was on their team um, that had an FJ Cruiser. So uh, I know that they've got a trip coming up to Allegheny uh, National Forest in that area. But they're, they've already got a video out on that. I think they're just doing it again. But his videos are really, really, really great. So uh, check out Spartan Overland. So another channel that's new to me, uh, relatively new to me, I should say, uh, is Appalachian Adventures. Um, he and his family, uh, so him, his wife, his daughter, uh, sometimes both of his daughters, uh, they go out in around Tennessee, uh, where, where they are based, so the Cherokee National Forest. They, they go waterfall hunting and they do some, uh, some pretty moderate trails and then they do some like harder, more challenging things get themselves into situations and get themselves out of situations um, but I've really enjoyed watching the videos I've really enjoyed actually uh, talking to them uh, as well hopefully we'll do some kind of ride together uh, because they are about an hour away from me so it's really not uh, it wouldn't be that big of a deal to, for me to drive up there and uh, go check out some trails with them I think that would be awesome um, but yeah so they're Tennessee based family oriented um, they do a lot of camping, they do a lot of like waterfall, hiking, exploration, that kind of stuff. Uh, and it's just a really great channel, so Appalachian Adventures. So staying with the overland and adventure travel motif, uh, I want you guys to check out uh, Spartan Over... Not Spartan. <laughs> check out Spartan Overland. I want you guys to check out Simply Must Go. Uh, Matt is an awesome dude. Uh, I've had the pleasure of meeting him several times, uh, whether it be at the WCG Fest or at the, uh, the Jeep Invasion um, in Pigeon Forge uh, last year. I didn't go this year, so I didn't see him there, but he was there as well this year. So if you want to see coverage of the shows and Jeep events that are around the Southeast, uh, that's definitely a channel uh, that you want to check out. But he also does, he has a YJ a project that he's working on right now. He has a Duke, uh, replica. Uh, Jurassic Park YJ that's called Sue. Then he has a JK and a trailer that he takes camping. And recently he took the JK and the trailer on uh, the Georgia Traverse with his boys uh, and some other friends. And yeah, he's really he's really focused on telling the story and you know really explaining the trails very well and the challenges and the obstacles that they go through. Uh, so it's a really great channel. 
Uh, so check out Simply Must Go. Um, yeah. And finally, guys, I would not be doing myself any justice whatsoever if I didn't mention Jeep and Bubba. Uh, you guys know him well if you watch this channel. Uh, we go on a lot of adventures together. Most recently, today, uh, we just went to Windrock and did the uh, Wheeling with Warren. Uh, before that, we went to Rim Contrail together. Uh, we did Land Between the Lakes together. Anyways, you guys know him. Go check out his channel. It's a Jeep and Bubba YouTube channel. Uh, or uh, Black Brown Fruit on Facebook. Uh, Black Brown for a trail team on Facebook. Uh, you can find them all there. And yeah, I am going to leave links to all of these channels in the description. So make sure you follow them all. Check out the channels. I am already losing my voice. Uh, so I hope you're living life adventurously. And until next time, I will see you on the trail.